Well, the experts are very worried right now because of the avalanches. I mean, you can look over here, that's Highway 2. That's bare and wet right now. That's not necessarily a good sign. As we look down here in the parking lot here at the ski area, you can see it's sloppy. We've got rain on top of snow. Now, let me show you some more pictures that we shot on the way up here. Now, avalanche control teams from the Washington State Department of Transportation they were out until six this morning controlling these slide chutes and you can look up above the highway and actually see them. They're the, uh, the gullies, if you will, that go up the mountain sides. Those they have to clear out. The concern here is all this rain on snow makes the upper levels very heavy. It's not frozen, so it's not locked in. And avalanche control, of course, is monitored both by the State Department of Transportation they handle the roads, the ski areas handle the ski areas, but out of bounds of the ski areas, and certainly in the backcountry, that is the biggest concern. And the warning from the National Weather Service and the Northwest Avalanche uh, Weather and Avalanche Center today is that people should not be back in the backcountry because of the likelihood of natural avalanches coming down. And people who get in, 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 in trapped in avalanches are very much in trouble. People are hiking, snowshoeing, snowmobiling, things like that. So that may not be the place to be today until this gets the all clear. Meanwhile, live at Stevens Pass, Glenn Farley, King 5 News.